Hey everybody, I'm Amy from Buddy Foot by Amy and this is your cardio mobility 10 minute quick hit. Because it is just 10 minutes, we are not gonna do much of a warm up, so you can go ahead and start marching and rolling those shoulders, moving your body just to get things warm before we get right in. So cardio and mobility. We will start with a cardio-based move where I'll give you both low impact and high impact options depending on what you need today, where you are, little tap back. And then we will follow that up with a corresponding mobility move that looks kind of similar, but is getting more mobility and flexibility. With all of it, I will give you lots of different options. You do what you need for this quick 10 minute workout. Everything is 40 seconds of work, followed by 20 seconds of rest. We are gonna be done fast. We're gonna start with our little side lunge. So stepping into it, reaching up, you can take it higher impact with the shuffle, or you can just step it low impact. Here we go, 40 seconds. Tap down, reach up, tap and reach. You decide how low you wanna get. If you want a little more of the leg work, you sit dip deep into that hip. Again, if you want a little more cardio, you shuffle it. It is wherever you are today. You know I always say that be where you are today. It can look different day to day, depending on where you are in your day, in your journey, in your fitness level. So if you need low impact, for whatever reason, keep it here. If you wanna really get that heart rate up, you can take a little shuffle. You can get your heart rate up either way. Three, two, one. All right, now let's open up those hips with a similar move. So we're gonna keep it nice and stationary. Heart rate's gonna come down. We're gonna take it here, reach it up, all the way through. Here, reach it up, all the way through. Join me in three, two, one. Here we go, 40 seconds mobility. Reach, and up. Take it down, reach. So I really want you to think sitting deep into the hip, if you can, so we get those hips open and feeling good, right? And then open up that chest, right? That's kind of hard to get. If you can get that rotation to open up through the spine, all the way up. We got 10 seconds. If you want, just sit a little deeper, side to side. We got five, four, three, two, one. Now that that heart rate is back down, let's take it back to some little cardio. So we're gonna tap it back. You can decide, you can just do tap backs and reach it up, or you can make it a little more of a jump, or if you're feeling it, get low in that lunge. Whatever is good for you today, 40 seconds, tap back or lunge. Here we go, tap, tap. Low impact, just shoot those arms up and tap. If you wanna get the lunge, you can. And again, if you wanna jump it, up to you, where you are. We're opening up the hips, but don't worry. Our next mobility move is gonna really get it done. And we'll keep it going. Here we go. Breathe. If you're really feeling the cardio, you can take it to that lunge jump, but you don't have to, 10 seconds. And breathe. We got three, two, one, yes. All right, so now we're gonna take it. World's greatest stretch, right? So drop it down. If you can, take this hand down, walk this foot over, reach it up, take it in, step it up. Then we get same thing, other side. Starting in three, two, one, here we go. Down, low, take that foot out, reach, and down, step it in, bring it up, down, Whew. walk that foot away, reach. Whew. So you can keep it just this pace. If you wanna add a little bit more, where you drop that knee a bit, like we do in our warm-ups, or you reach it under and up a bit, go for that. Up to you, 10 seconds, and you get one more. Drop the knee, reach it under, yes and breathe, step it in, round it out. Ha ah, ha, there we go. All right, team, inch worm. You know it, you love it. If you'd rather stay up top, you can just reach it down, reach it up, it's a hinge. If you're able to, walk it all the way out and walk it all the way back. Here we go in three, two, one, 
Cardio. And breathe. And walk it back, right? Up to you if you want to add a little more cardio. You can jump it, turn it, walk it out this way, jump it, turn it. You're going to get the cardio either way. That inchworm tends to get the heart rate up. So it is totally up to you with what you want. Here we go. Inchworm. Breathe. And here, inchworm. Or just walk it back. Five seconds. You got one more. Whoo. Breathe. And back. And relax. All right, you're gonna love this mobility. You're gonna reach it down, reach it up, stretch, and stretch. Whatever works for you. You don't have to get that leg super high, but flex that foot, big arms. Three, two, one. Here we go. Reach and up. So instead of taking it down, that inchworm in itself is a mobility move, but as you can tell, it gets that heart rate up, right? Reach and up, stretch and stretch. Really lean into the stretch of that big arms. Really flex that foot, hamstrings. And as you're going down, you're not just reaching down, you're hinging at the stretch. Bring it up. Five seconds to go. Can you get one more? Yes, you can. Whoo! All right, team. Back to cardio. We're almost there. We're gonna take hamstring curls with a pull down. So I really want you to focus on opening up the shoulders, pulling it down, squeezing and squeezing. Legs to the back. You can keep it low impact. You can add a jump, whatever you need in three, two, one. Here we go. Cardio, hamstring curl and pull down. You can even pick up the pace without the jump. Again, lower impact or slower, up to you. Jump it if you want. Yes. Heart rate up, but again, everything we're doing is also a mobility move. So opening up the chest, bringing them up right here, right? 10 seconds that everything else is on the mat. So let's get it done. Breathe. Yes. We got three, two, one. Relax, meet me on the mat. We're gonna take it down right here. So same motion with our arms. We're gonna get that floor angel where you're going up and down. While we're doing that, we're also going to open book with our legs. Bring those knees side to side, little stretch. Bring them center, bring them up, bring them down. Join me, here we go. So floor angels. Take those knees side to side, little stretch. Floor angels, open up the shoulders. Feel how tight we are right there. So I'm doing them separately. Certainly if you feel okay to keep it moving, but allow yourself a little stretch each time those knees go down, right? If you want, you can even hold it a few more seconds on that side while you're going through your floor angels up and down. And then other side, breathe. Yes, good, relax. Awesome work, team. We're coming into a plank position. If you wanna keep it low impact mobility, you just take it to bird dog. Otherwise, we're tapping it in for mountain climber for two. T, rotation, getting the stretch. Here we go, last two moves, three, two, one. Tap it, tap it, T, rotation. Back in, tap, tap. If you wanna run it, you can. Four, three, two, one. Take it here, sorry, that should have been two. And here, tap, tap. Open it up. You can also just keep the tap, tap, tap. Bring it up. Yes! Feel that core working, 10 seconds while we also stretch out the hips and reach. Last one. Time and relax. So child's pose, stretch. Stay right there. Last one is of, is of course our down dog. You have a few options. You can just go cat cow to down dog or you can go all the way to up dog. It is up to you in three, two, 
one. So you're either here, cat, cow, down dog, either back to center, right through here, or if you want the full range, you're gonna take it forward, roll it up, bring it up, and curl those toes, press it back. Totally up to you. Not everybody likes that full flow all the way down. I know it gets a little challenging, but it is a good mobility move. Take it down. Totally fine just to go to the knees, roll through the back, cat cow, last one. Pedal those feet and stretch it back. Child's pose, hang out in that child's pose. You did it, that was it. 10 minute quick hit. Hopefully you felt that cardio, reach forward. Hopefully you felt, whoo, little stretch. Side to side. You can reach one arm under with that as well. And hopefully you felt that mobility. This is a great workout if you need something, roll back onto your feet, pedal. If you need something to wake up in the morning, even if you don't even change clothes, if you're still in pajamas, you just get moving, you get the low impact versions to wake up your body, but also get that good mobility work. It's also a great finisher at the end of the workout. It's almost like a little extended cool down. So remember this workout, save it to your favorites. If you need something extra in your day or your week, or it's just a day that you're short on time, but you need some movement, get it in. This is a good one for you. Let's roll through our back flat down and round it up a couple more just like that. Don't forget to let me know in the comments what you thought. Like this video and please subscribe. That helps me out, helps me keep making these workouts for you. And of course, check out all the links in the description below. If you're looking for equipment, you wanna join us in the Body Fit Athletic Club, make sure you follow me at Body Fit by Amy and I will see you again soon. One big deep breath in and out. That was your cardio mobility 10 minute quick hit. Great job, everybody.